Your opening contest for Empire State Wrestling Ring Wars is a singles match scheduled for one fall. Introducing first. Fans, I want to welcome you to ESW Ring Wars. You are watching this exclusive match right here on Facebook Live. I'm Scotty Bender alongside my man that rides shotgun on this long ride on the stagecoach, Ivan the Impel. Great to be here, Scotty. We see a match right now with some, some fallout, if you will, from the Illegal DePaulo Cup match at the last show. Kevin Blackwood managed by the Caesar in that unholy union with Jerk Hawkins and Lady Lala. And they're facing off against Sean Carter, the hybrid, a man who's appeared on Ring of Honor TV and was in their top prospects during it. This should be an interesting contest. You talk about Kevin Blackwood. What a shooting star this wrestler has been making an impact, not only in ESW, but up and down the East Coast, Canada. Continuing his way. Now, oh, super kick! Hello, Jerk Hawkins! He just rearranged it. That'll work. Sean Carter with some sweet chin music. Jerk Hawkins should be able to take care of that. Well, he took care of it, all right? He took care of himself. He's out of the match, and referee Andrew Mullen rings the bell. We are underway. Blackwood on the attack on Sean Carr with some knees. No reverse Irish whip by Carr. Duck under by Blackwood. Oh, misses again, does Carr. Oh, but wait a minute, Caesar. Presence of mind to pull. Blackwood out of the ring. Wait a minute, Evan. Carr out through the middle rope, takes out Caesar and Blackwood. Caesar has no hesitancy to get himself to all the matches, Scotty Bender. He tried to do it right there. But him and Kevin Blackwood end up eating that suicide copay from Sean Carr. Oh, down the outside, Carr with a big knife that's chopped across the chest of Blackwood. Blackwood looking for higher ground as Carr's on the attack still here on the outside. Oh, again, knife that's right across the chest. The last show, which was won by Kevin Bennett, but Again, Caesar kind of uh, stuck his nose in it and cost John Carroll the opportunity to stay in that match. Ivan, what a crowd here, standing room. Oh no! Here at the St. John's Burke Fire Hall, great crowd here on hand for ESW Ring Wars. I think there's so many people away at the door. There's so many folks here at the St. John's Burke Fire Hall in beautiful downtown North Carolina, New York. And now Caesar again getting involved. His acts are just deplorable. Well. He has a history of getting involved when he should. Remember when he was managing Will Calrissian? Calrissian was the champion, but Caesar pulled strings and had Dave Linton coming as a special referee. And even I, Scotty Bender, I'm a fan of the Caesar. Oh, cover. I'm a fan of the Caesar, but Dave Linton did not call it right down the middle. He was a hack. And deplorable. His actions are just simply deplorable. I, I just. One could say that. I, I, call, I call Caesar a genius. He's a bit unstable, but he is a genius, Scotty. He's a troublemaker. Oh, spinning heel kick up the middle inside. Rogo, Black with a cover. Two. What a feather in the cap if he can defeat 
Sean Carr here tonight. He is a rising star here in the He's got all those tattoos on his arm, Scotty Bender. He's got you a few tattoos, right? Just a few. Yeah, but what happens when you get old and your skin gets saggy? What happens to your tattoos then? I don't know. I'll worry about that when I get old. If we get old, Scotty. Because in this business, nobody gets old. Mullen. Not only has to control the action, the ring, but he's got Lady Lala and Caesar on the outside. He's got to get ten with. Oh, and that black one, stiff kick, right between the back. Of Sean Carr now locks him up with a rear chin lock, and he's isolating that right arm of Carr. But again, he's he's been on the national stage with Ring of Honor. This guy, these are two up and coming stars. Scotty Bender, five years from now, people will look back at this match and say, "Yeah, hey, you remember when I saw Kevin Blackman and Sean Carr before they hit the national stage?" Yeah. And now Carr trying to fight back again, go right back to those knife edge chops. He found effective when this contest started. Now Blackwood, nice agility there. Oh, and then into a long blower, driving the knees right to the shoulder legs. And only a two. Lower, guys. Literally takes a lot of air out of you. What will Sean Carr's stamina and energy level be like for the rest of this match? Now Carr trying to get to his vertical base. You can see Blackwood just stalking him, waiting to get to his vertical base. Now wraps his arms around the ring, but now returns the... Oh! Ow! Again, working on the chest. You know, maybe injure a rib along the way, cut down his oxygen supply. Kevin Blackwood may be devious, but he is a smart wrestler, Sonny. He is a smart wrestler. Now he's got Caesar in his corner, which makes him that much more dangerous. Hey, Caesar is the wild card, literally in figure to the low. Nice step up in Seguri there. Black was on. He's on rubber legs, Scotty. Now Carl looking to capitalize. Oh, 360, 360 discus forearm by Blackwood. He's got Carl. Oh. Who's a kick by Carbon? Oh, and then a high knee strike by Blackwood. Get in there! Come on! Something's got to give eventually. These guys cannot keep up this pace for the entire match. Oh, those running European uppercuts. But Carbon right behind. Oh! Climbs a ladder, drives a knee right into the face of Blackwood, but he goes, oh, a third! Heavy blows here. Oh! Big form, Larian! Blackwood's head almost ended up in the first row. That 360 lariat by Carr and the momentum of Blackwood running into the path of that lariat. And now Carr scoops up. Oh! Variation of, yes. You've been doing your homework. I've been watching the camera these days, Scotty Bender. And everyone should. Seesaw battle so far, but a lot of heavy artillery being thrown in this match. No car. Got Blackwood up on his shoulders with Blackwood fighting out of those elbows. Again, car grabs him. Oh, rolls through. To the middle rope. Oh! And the cover! Two! No! match is not going to go the time limit, I can tell you that. Someone's going to win pretty soon. What an opening contest here at Ring Wars. This opening contest could be a main event in any building in the Eastern U.S. Sky. Scoops him up. Wait a minute, now Black rearranges his weight. Throws Carr in. Ducks underneath. Goes for a suplex of his own. Oh, that turns into a cutter. And the cover. One, two, upset here. No. Did you see Kevin Blackwood switch the position when Carr was in the middle? That takes incredible speed and agility on the part of Kevin Blackwood, turning it into a cutter. You should just see that chest of Kevin Blackwood, just red from the blows, the chops from Carr. Now going up to the high rent district here in St. Johnsburg. Blackwood, where eagles fly? Oh, no water in the pool. Now Carr, waiting for Blackwood, but you can see for free A. Mullen being distracted by Lady Lala. Mullen will be distracted by any woman, but look at the Caesar standing. Oh, he just gave him something, a chain. It looks like wrapped around the wrist of Blackwood. Mullen, the referee, did not sit. He was distracted by the lovely Lady Lala. Now Blackwood's going upstairs. Oh, top row Balbo. The cover, no. One, two, three. This match is over. Win for 
Kevin Blackwood with the big assist to the Caesar, Scotty. Again, deplorable. Your words, not mine, Scotty Bender. He's a genius, an unstable genius, but a genius nonetheless. Wow, what a big win here for Kevin Blackwood to open up ESW Ring Wars. It's not going to go down. That Blackwood used a chain to win. It's just going to go down as a victory in the books. Your winner, Kevin Blackwood.